A social media post is stirring up a lot of speculation about a local rapper who was the lone survivor of that deadly shooting near the St. John's Town Center last week. That rapper's name is Keontae Bullard, also known as Young and Ace. The social media post has reached thousands tonight and even caused some issues for the Jacksonville Sheriff's Office over the weekend. Tonight, I'm verifying some of that information for you, separating fact from fiction. This is the social media post in question that has more than 121,000 likes on Worldstar Hip Hop's Instagram page, a popular social media account for urban culture. The post reads, quote, the Jacksonville police just arrested Ace. He is sitting in jail, not in the hospital where he belongs. The detectives should be doing their jobs and looking for the killers, not locking up the victim. At the end of the post, you can see a number is given out. That number is listed on JSO's website as their non-emergency number. The message says people should call and ask for the nurse's office because Young and Ace needs his medicine. It appears Worldstar reposted this from an Instagram user with the name Johnny Shipes. I sent that Instagram user a message about where this information came from, but he didn't respond. However, we received this email from the Jacksonville Sheriff's Office around 2 early Saturday morning. This is what Public Information Officer Melissa Bujeda had to say. It says that the Communications Center was receiving hundreds of calls in a short amount of time because of the social media post, and that those calls were delaying people who actually needed police assistance. To put that in perspective for you, in a follow-up email from Officer Bujeda, she says JSO received 156 calls between midnight and 5 a.m. the day before the social media post. When that message was posted, JSO received more than 1,500 calls on the non-emergency number and 911 number in the same time frame. Officer Bujeda says the misuse of the 911 or the 911 system is an offense and you can be arrested. She further clarified that the social media post is incorrect. Officer Bujeda says Young and Ace was not removed from the hospital. She says after he was released from the hospital, he reported to his probation office, and that is when he was arrested. Jail records show he was booked into jail on Friday for violation of probation. It was in reference to a case in Clay County from 2017. I swear that they can see greatness in me. Yeah. This video, which was posted on Instagram the day he was taken to jail, shows Young and Ace riding in the back of a vehicle with a bandaged head. He had posted earlier while he was in the hospital that he was shot eight times. However, when I reached out to UF Health, they couldn't verify that information. So we can verify that Young and Ace is in jail, but it is false that he was arrested while in the hospital. As for the condition of his health, that's information we don't have at this time. If you have anything you would like for us to verify, just email us at verify at firstcoastnews.com.